We'll get an update on the contaminated ground site in Northwest Springfield. Caitlin Schumacher tells us where the property is and what neighbors can expect to learn. Caitlin? Good morning. For a hundred years, this area right here served as the Kerr McGee site. Now, what was going on here was this was a um, company that ma manufactured and treated railroad ties. It's right here on High Street. So, just for references in North Springfield, right up here, this is Kearney Street. And right over here is the Greene County Highway Department. Now, back in 1907, the company Kerr McGee began using creosote, a compound now known to cause cancer to treat railroad ties. Now this led to contamination to the soil and water. Now there are lots of residential neighborhoods in that area that could have been impacted by the contamination. Kermagee was decommissioned in 2004 and the multi-state trust was established to investigate and clean up the facility. Now since the facility is near neighborhoods, multi-state trust is prioritizing off-site contamination. Residents can learn about the progress that has been made and the process behind some of those cleanup efforts. The groundwater corrective actions involve extracting contaminated groundwater and recovering creosote and that uh, contaminated groundwater is ran through an oil water separator system and um, the wastewater treatment uh, facility is here on site and that water is then discharged under permit to the sanitary sewer. Alte State Trust will not cover personal injury or property claims at tonight's meeting. The meeting will take place tonight at 6 o'clock at the American Legion Post 676 on North Clifton Street. Live in the studio, I'm Caitlin Schumacher. All right, Caitlin, thank you so much.